we can actually push you down and make a bit of a shortcut back up this way. So that's that's good. That's nice. That's dandy. I'm going to take a pity save because I'm bad and kind of annoyed. But uh, there's another Ogdo down here and somewhere that we can push down a giant sort of metal uh, walkway. And that will take us somewhere completely different. Somewhere we haven't explored before. Now, can I do the thing? Oh, that's not how you do the thing. Hold on. Drop down without your sticky hands. There we go. Alright, you good? We're gonna fight? We're gonna do this again? Oh god, he's doing the thing. He's doing the weird thing where he's gonna be like floating sometimes. S like small areas and- Oh, uh, you wallywog. <laughs> Goddamn asshole. Alright, let's leave. I am not doing great on my combat here today. No, sir. Go push this down. And immediately we are rewarded with treasure. Where are we? BD1, we don't need to worry about this guy. Look at him. He's just acting like a dum dum. <laughs> look at him. He's just like posing. He's like, hey, look at me. All right. Slice her up. Let's see what we got. More poncho materials, perhaps? Hey, no. Something better. Hmm. Ooh, the zigag wave. Like zigzagoon? Is that what you're telling me? Ooh, no. That is uh, quite the bold statement there, my friend. Sure. Well, why not? Black and pink? Sure. You can rock it. All right. So if we head on over here, we're back at the Great Divide. Oh, it's this. Okay. Pog in here. The abandoned workshop. This is worth our time. Is there anything behind here, though? Thought maybe there might have been. No. This will also lead us to another shortcut, I believe. So that's going to be kind of cool. Uh, let's keep on climbing up. And if this is the spiral staircase, how's it going, buddies? I liberated one of your friends, and uh, I stowed him away on my ship. I hope you guys don't mind. <laughs> Look at him jumping. All right, this will take us to a bit of a shortcut. Surprise, surprise. Oh, no. Good work, BD1. This is different. This is Cordova's workshop, I think. My friend, I flew with all haste to Coruscant and presented my findings to the Council. Hmm. This health belonged to Cordova. Feels weird to say about someone I've never met, but it's kind of comforting. I agree. This place is special. I'm taking this hilt with us. Okay, we can have that just go way off in the back. Uh, let's switch some of this. We have the Saracote. I actually am a pretty big fan of that one. And then we also unlocked the Arsitron. That looks pretty cool, too. Uh, with that, uh, Elemental Nature will keep. Though, this must... I think this is the one we just picked up. The Eno Cordova hilt. I would say that we should probably wear it, but I'm just a fan of Elemental Nature. Don't know why. Uh, that actually looks kind of cool, too. Hmm. Duty and Resolve 2. You know... Let's go with Duty and Resolve. That one sounds good. And we'll switch this one a little bit. Hey, oh my god, look at that. That is uh, quite the statement as well. You know what? I'm going to follow him beating one's tiny little footsteps. And we're going to be the boldest of them all. And let's, you know, and let's switch to orange. It's been a minute. Someone might be wondering why I haven't been using it, but someone might also be wondering why I haven't been using the double-bladed lightsaber. You guys remember we still have that? <laughs> All right, now, BD1. All right, what do you got? Oh, the droid cairn. Okay, whatever you say. This is the thing you actually wanted to come here for. Let's get it. Cordova's repair kit. He hoped someone would pick up his trail, but left BD1 to guide them. For sure, old memoirs. Very cool. Okay. Now, we can continue heading on up here. And this would be good for us because we can now basically fast track our way back over here near where the, uh, whatchamacallit is. Uh, the vault is right over there. So, nice easy way to just make a straightaway right over there. But we're going to drop all the way back down because... Whoop, water. Hooray. 
there's a little bit more to this area than meets the eye. And I think it does loop back around, but we want to make sure to get this all nice and situated. Check it out. That's another one of these slides. So we'll jump and prepare. Oh, there is a vine. Nice, good catch there, Cal. Whoop. Did you see, it just kind of flung me off in a different direction. That's crazy. And we got one of these. Four senses, I think, beyond. Bones. Uh. Yeah, but they're incredibly old. Can't tell much from them. Oh, guys. I don't appreciate your business here. Alright, let's see if I can do this without taking, like, obscene amounts of damage. Uh, I did kill one of them. Interesting. Alright, we're good. What do we got here? There's a lot of you guys. Jesus. Hmm. Ancient burial site. Yeah, resting place. Something tells me it's no good. And we're back here. Well, by back here, I mean back to the slide, so hooray! Where does this take us? I don't remember this. Alright, momentum is a thing. Okay, so I don't think we can grab that force sense or that essence that was hiding above the subterranean refuge quite yet either. Oh, hey, how's it going, Palio? Don't know how you were able to fend me off there for a second, but that's fine. Holy smokes, uh, really great job on the uh, loading there game. Okay, now, you, you, yeah. Virtually no experience, but that's fine. Oh, hi. You're still one more. Okay, so I think this is probably the fastest way back, right? Because we don't want to head towards... We actually want to leave now. So I think we're more or less finished with what we need to do here. Which means our next our next stop is Kashyyyk. And I'm a little worried about that place because uh, that area gave me a lot of trouble the first time I played. And it is not fun. Okay, so I don't want to go there. I want to go back. Can I go back from here? Do I need to basically resign myself to doing nonsense pertaining to just going forward to go back, you know? Jesus, why are there so many of you? Maybe... You guys, oh boy. Uh, this is a bad, bad plan. You know what? <laughs> there we go. All right. A double-bladed saber does have its uses around here, apparently. Ugh, just not a normal combat, you know. Alright, crowd control. Name of the game! Let's leave. Go, go! Oh, you know what? We can actually grab treasure up here. Because there was a bunch of, or at least one sliced. Yeah, there it is. Let's grab it. I completely forgot about this one. Although, combat. Thanks, game. Man, those guys die really quick. Even from the weak double-blade. Alright. Anyone else? I don't think there is. Need to use this. There you go. What do we got? Oh, that was helpful. <laughs> hey now. Hmm. What's that easy one? Ooh, corundum. I do like that. Uh, yeah, I think that's it for up here. Okay. So if we slide down here, that is gonna take us closer to where we need to go to uh, do stuff. Later? Can I even head over there to where that is? I think I can. So we'll zip line. Huh. And we don't want to go there. This is where I want to go. I'm gonna make that mistake twice. How to do, friend? Whoop! Mistimed. There we go. Okay. We'll go back here. And should we yeah, we'll go and do this. Although, ooh. Can I get back from here? Do I just not remember this area as much as I used to? Like I mentioned, this is probably my least explored planet. Uh, the other ones, I think, are just so much more accessible, and this one's so small. Huh. Alright. Well, I say, because we have two, and it's going to be a minute before we get our next upgrade for our force. Uh, I just don't want to bother with the force. Evasive kick. Because if you... Okay, so this is what it looks like. You just go and take a sidestep, and then you do a kick. And sometimes you just want to slash instead of using your foot. But um, it's always like screwed me in situations where you'll kick like a giant animal. 
and then you'll just be like, well, wait a minute, I wanted to actually slice them, but we'll grab it just to have it because it's cheap and uh, we might be able to put it to good use. So it might help. We might be able to kick someone off an edge or kill someone with only our feet. Alternatively, we can also grab this and this might be useful in this next area for reasons you will see later. But like I mentioned before, you can't deflect the blasters back at the person with that. You still need to time it. And in this scenario, you're literally just <laughs> waving your lightsaber around like a madman. Just like your master taught you. So we're good. We're set. Uh, let's go home. I'm ready to take a quick nap on the mantis. And I was really hoping there would have been some something here that I could use to climb up. But that is not the case. I thought there was vines here, but there's not. Good God. All right, well... I more or less screwed myself, so let's go over here. How's it going, friend? Let's go ahead and uh, put you down. And this looks like this is where we would be backtracking to. But no, just more ancient Zepho artifacts. Ugh. Damn, I wish there were better zip lines here. Damn it! All right, we're we're gonna we're gonna take the long way forward to take the short way back. If that makes any sense. Also, I hear that Ogdo. I hear him doing his business up here. Excuse me, sir. I know we've had our differences in the past, but I'm just going to kindly ask you to leave me be. I'm going to run away and uh, not deal with any of your nonsense today. I'm just going to go this way. And where we saw the giant statue or skeleton bones, and the game is being really slow, <laughs> we'll drop down over here. And we can also go through here. Although that's not really a shortcut we want to take back. <laughs> now we already mostly made our way where we needed to. I do want to go to that area. Oh, wait a minute. Sweet, shortcut, again. Nice. Uh, can't go that way. Hmm. Hmm, <laughs> hmm, let's, hmm. Let's head over here. This is going to be, whoop, okay. Don't know why you jumped in such a weird way there. We're going to go back to that uh, Ogdo Bogdo arena so that we can uh, grab that one last chest. And then I think we'll be all square for every area we've been with all of the abilities. Except for that one, the one on Zepho. Which, again, is one of those things you just have to go back to, but that's fine. Uh, Alright, yeah, we'll go here. Whew. Watch real B. Please and thank you. All right, was it worth our time? Please. So what was in there? Ooh, the Sumi. You know, I did really like this outfit, but this one is the best of them. Oh man, I am officially a uh, tutti fruity cotton candy ass ice cream flavored poncho man, and it's great. Oh my god. All right, life worked out for us. This was certainly worth the revisit. <laughs> in all capacity, and uh, we can now head back to the Mantis with our head held high. Certainly a treasure that is uh, a benefactor to defeating a legendary beast. I'm glad we did it, and life will be good. Speaking of which, the Kashyyyk legendary beast is absolutely terrifying, and uh, prepare yourself for it, because it's going to be rough. Uh, if you're an arachnophobe, then uh, I would probably not tune in for those, but you don't have to be an arachnophobe to not tune into these videos. So, hooray. Uh, let's head back. The man Squinting in the light. I was <laughs> taken aback by the beauty that I almost fell into the pit. Much like I'm sure a lot of people did. Alright, so it's actually going to be quite a while before we return here. I don't think there's anything that is worth our time, even after our next force visit, so... Ladies and gentlemen, say goodbye to Bagano for the time being as we head back onto the Mantis and finish our time here in Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. Let's keep making progress. Indeed. Also, have you noticed how fabulous we look right now? Holy smokes. Pink for days. I love it. So we'll head up here. Uh, Grease probably has nothing for us. Nothing but nothing. Huh. All right. And our turn. Oh, we. Too quiet. For sure. Look at we've got a couple of sprouts. Oh, look at them. They're adorable. They're growing at the same time. It's like they're all in the same cycle or something. Perfect. Whew. All right. Well, my voice is about to give out, even though I have not been recording nearly as much today as I was hoping to. But next time, 
on the game, you guys. We're heading to Kashyyyk, and that is going to be a war zone of epic proportions and uh, prepare for a lot of combat and a lot of very unusual things. I'm not looking forward to it, but, well, maybe you should. I'll see you guys here next time.